The Sistine Chapel is one of the most famous painted interior spaces in the world and seeing it in person is a bucket list item for so many people. Well, now you don't have to travel to see it. A new experience is going to bring it here to Tampa Bay. This morning, ABC Action News reporter Sean Daly takes us to West Shore Plaza for a sneak peek at a new exhibit on Michelangelo's masterpiece. Seeing people walk in the way we set it up and just seeing all the art kind of hit them at once, their, their jaws drop. And for us as producers and creators of, of this exhibition, it's really rewarding to see that. When you go to the original, are these very close to the color? Event producer Tobias Lerman Matante is giving me a sneak peek of Michelangelo's Sistine Chapel, the exhibition. Now sprawling out at Tampa's West Shore Mall. This intimate experience features 34 in-your-face recreations of Michelangelo's iconic ceiling frescoes in Vatican City. Not only capture the quality of the image, but actually capture the texture and the color like you would see it in the actual chapel. Tobias's company, C Global Entertainment, has also produced exhibitions on the Titanic and Star Trek. They know how to entertain. Seeing those reactions on people's faces always just makes your day. The Sistine Chapel recreated in an old Sears. Who'd have thunk it? The exhibition opens today. Tickets start at $20. It'll take you about 60 to 90 minutes to see this whole beautiful thing. In Tampa, I'm Sean Daly, ABC Action News. Good. Tickets 20 bucks as opposed to how much would it cost you for a flight? Oh. <laughs> That's a much better deal. You price yeah. flights this summer? Hello. Even with gas as high as it yeah. is to get over the West Shore, still a good deal. Great value there. That's the way <laughs> to do yeah. it. Yeah. Old sure. Sears. <laughs> yeah. And you look where the lawn garden department used to be. Here's David. <laughs> uh, I mean, that is... It, that's what's happening, right? But it's a good use of the space. It is a great use of the space, and it really does bring you closer and probably get a better view of some of those uh, paintings than you would if you actually went over towards Italy.